what is up just before i get started into the video go subscribe leave a like because we are doing a giveaway at 200 subs so you don't want to miss that in it so just go leave a like and cut and just subscribe and so i could get to 200 subscribers and we could do that giveaway so as you could probably already tell by the thumbnail and title we are doing a restoration of these uh white hirachis of mine as you can tell they're probably like very dirty right here especially on the um top of part it's like all muddy and over here and like especially the laces too so we're going to do a full restoration of these but i did do a video like this it was called like cleaning of gucci shoes um but it wasn't like a restoration it was just like cleaning and all that they weren't as dirty as these are so yeah we're gonna get right to it so let's get started so first of all what you need is you need um this crep thing all right it's like a crep kit you could just get it for like 10 pounds 10 dollars depends where you are you could get a full locker jd finish line anything so yeah you got that you just put um i've already filled it up so i don't want to like tilt it but like there's a yellow part and there's like a black part you put like hot or cold water in it and then it comes with this it's called a uh, crepe cure it comes in it and basically i'm just going to open it and i'm going to put like around 10 to 15 drops in it with the water and now that that's there 10 to 15 drops um you just uh it just mixes for a little while like 5 10 seconds and then you and then it also comes with the crepe protect brush and the crepe protect and the crepe protect oh you know uh, the thing handkerchief or whatever, whatever you want to call it which you wipe it off with so yeah we've got that and then let's get into it but first we need to take out the laces so we can fully clean the shoe and we could um clean the laces or maybe even switch them i don't know what i'm gonna do yet so i'm just gonna start the time lapse now so we could yeah continue on okay guys so now i'm done with the um laces took them out and everything you see all clean now they're right here now i'm just gonna put them to the side over here and start cleaning the shoes and my brother in the meantime and so did my cousin came along they said they just want to like be over here so just say hi i guess hi they can't see you hi hi cringiness okay so yeah let's get started into it and yeah so we're just gonna start cleaning i'll do a little time lapse of that basically all you have to do you take the brush oh hold on so you take the brush where you put the water and like the crepe cure you just mix it up a little and then you start rubbing it so i'm just going to show you guys and then we'll start the time lapse you you just rub it and then start like doing that that the whole time in it and then you just do it all around and then you like keep on putting it back and forth back and forth and then that's how it gets clean and then after it gets like a little bubbly so you just wipe it off like that and then eventually it gets clean. So I'll do a time lapse on that. And then after that, I'll see you guys. So yeah. Alright guys, so now I've decided I'm just going to use these laces for now. I'll show you guys how to clean them, but I do I don't have a fresh pair of white laces right now. So when I do get them, I'll just, you know, um, put them in. I'm probably going to get them tomorrow, but for now, let's start this right now. We're just going to dip it in. I'm just, just going to show you guys how to clean them. So you just dip it in where like you put the soap, like the crepe cure and everything, like right here, and the water. You just dip it in. And then you just like mix it all together. It's a little disgusting, but it is hard to get it clean. So I'm just gonna like all like, put it in together, rub it, and then you just just keep on rubbing it until you're done. So I'm just gonna keep on rubbing it for a while. Like you rub it for like five ten minutes, and then it's all good. And then I'll show you guys what to do after. So, okay, yeah. guys, it's been five minutes now. I've been rubbing it all together now, and they look like this now. So now we're just gonna go like take them apart like this. And I'm gonna just go hang them somewhere, like maybe a doorknob like over here. Or maybe like something like you just like hang them anywhere in the bathroom or wherever you wanna hang it. And then they just dry for five to six hours. 
So yeah, I'm just gonna go leave it to dry there and then I'll see you guys. Okay guys, what is up? So as I said, we just put the laces out and like we cleaned them and everything. And I put them uh, drying on the dryer, like the thingy. So yeah, I don't know why my brother just ran up and down like four times to get something. So yeah, um, we are almost done with the shoes. They are looking right so far. So yeah, just a couple more like little touches and then I'll be on my way. And then yeah, so actually I think I might just be able to finish it right now. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna clean it right now, and then after I'm done cleaning, I'll see you guys in 12 hours. So basically tomorrow, because these need to dry for a good 12 hours to look pristine and in good condition, and like then just they just need time to like recover and all that. I know it does sound dumb, but yeah, that is how it works. So I'll see you. I'm almost like done, and I'm just gonna leave it for like drying. Um, I don't know, like in my room for 12 hours. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. And yeah, bye. So yeah. Okay, guys. So it's been twelve hours. I'm back. So yeah, I have put the shoelaces in and everything right here, as you can see. So let's show you guys. It's all white now from the bottom, right here. I mean, I think it's pretty clean now and all that. I'll put a before and after picture up any second now, or maybe I'll just put it up as my thumbnail. So yeah. But I will show you guys how it was before and after in a minute right now. After I'm done showing you guys. This is the other pair. So both of them are right here. Clean both of them, you know what I'm saying. They're all good now. So, But what I am going to do now. I've talked about these pre in my previous videos. They're called shoe trees. You could get them from anywhere. You could get them from Ikea, JD Sports, um, um, Selfridges, Nordstrom Rack, anywhere. And they just help uh, keep your uh, shoe in form. So since I just cleaned them, I'm just going to put them in here for about like 12, 24 hours. Because like the next time I'm going to wear these, I don't know when I'm going to wear these next. But yeah. So let's just put these in. Alright. So we've put them in. And now it'll be all straightened up. So like as you can see now, it's like all in form. So I'm just going to put those to the side. Go buy this... um. Crop protect if you want it's called crop protect cure and it's like pretty sick and all that so yeah and yeah so just go subscribe leave a like and you know what i'm saying so if you guys go subscribe get me to 200 subscribers i will be doing a giveaway on a gift card i think most probably and yeah also shout out to my brother he asked for this one uh rahim's vlogs i'll link his um channel in the description below and i'll also link down my previous video or like when i did the cleaning of gucci shoes and not these and yeah, so go sub to my brother, go sub to me. He's also going to be doing a giveaway. I just wanted there for no reason. He's not even over here. He's also going to be doing a giveaway at 50 subscribers on like, I think like a gift card or something he said. So yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Enjoy.